I've been here at Rosa Parks for two years and teaching in Middletown for two years. My mom teaches here in Middletown. She's taught here for about 25 years. Um, so I've grown up coming to her classroom and just helping her on my days off and that's really what made me want to be a teacher. The summer after I graduated college, I worked at the Robert Sunny Hill Community Center here in Middletown, which is actually in the Rosa Parks community and that kind of made me fall in love with Rosa Parks. Before school even starts, I go out, um, I get my class list, and I go to each student's house, and um, I give them kind of just a little treat, and I say, hey, I'm your teacher. And it's nice to get to see their houses, because like this is our home, and this is our family. So getting to see their house and their family, it just starts the year off, and you just hit the ground running. I hope that they learned that this is a safe place, that my classroom door is always open, and that really I'm just there for them, like inside and outside of the classroom. So with the expansion, we wanted to come up with a new framework for um, students learning and so we came up with challenge-based learning. And this summer, I get to go to the Digital Promise Challenge-Based Learning Institute conference. And so I get to be on the ground floor of that and bring it back to Rosa Parks to the staff and the students and roll out this whole new way of learning. Hashtag mini rising means just rising up to the occasion, trying new things, giving our new students experiences that will really benefit them. I love coming to school and giving students opportunities that they wouldn't have otherwise, um, whether it be learning or just really embracing the STEAM movement, allowing them to express themselves in the way that they're gifted in, whether it be art or science or anything, just giving them different ways to show what they know. Hashtag MIDI Rising, hashtag This Is We.